welcome back to your new lesson in this lesson i am going to show you how you can smooth the data using convolution network in previous tutorial i had shown you how to remove high frequency noises using filter command using smooth data command and using escola filtering technique and here i am going to show you how you can remove noise from a two dimensional data using convolution so before that we need to create a two dimensional data that can be created using peaks method peaks command so peaks function it takes let's peaks 100 now it has created a two dimensional data z 100 by 100 of dimension now we need to put here labels labels is minus 7 to 10 okay and then we are going to plot this contour we can simply plot this z and then labels now you will see here this is our actual data which we had generated now and now we are going to inject a random noise into this data so let's inject that random noise in this data noise is equal to z plus rand and this is 100 size and then minus 0.5 okay and now we are going to print uh, we are going to uh, contour we are going to plot this into contour so it's noise and then levels now you will see here a noise this is very noisy data and it is almost uh, you know un understandable you cannot understand what is this data two dimensional data now we are going to perform here two dimensional convolution so the two dimensional convolution can be done using convo2 okay so if you type here convo2 you will see here it shows that convo2 performs a two dimensional convolution of matrices a and matrices b and for that now the matrix a can be considered as this noise matrix and the matrix b is considered as a filtering coefficient so in the two dimensional it is known as a kernel so the kernel do not need to be same size as the input okay it is like a filter coefficient do not need to be same size as the input so here in two dimensional kernel is not need to be same size as a input so here we are going to perform a filtering using five cross five kernel size so k is equal to 0.0 Five and multiplied by ones and then five, right? So it will create a kernel five cross five. Now let's print it here smooth. Sorry, let's calculate a smooth data. Smooth is equal to convert to that is two dimensional convolution between noise with kernel k, and we are going to pass a parameter same. same will force this output as the same size of a input now we are going to plot this parameter using subplot so our subplot have a three row one column and for the first one i am going to plot this contour which has actual data that is z and then levels right and then i am going to subplot a second subplot i'm going to do second subplot using that noise and then i am going to do third subplot third subplot is a smooth data 
plot it I type here shg now you will see let me maximize this figure so the first figure is a uh, smooth data sorry first figure is original data and here it has no eyes and this third one is filtered data and we had filtered it using convolution second dimensional convolution since filter and sgoli filter is only applied for single dimensional so here we had used convolution 2 that is sing double that is a uh, you know uh, two dimensional convolution network so thank you so much for watching this video and uh, please do not forget to subscribe this channel so that you can get update directly into your inbox bye bye have a nice day Thank you.